Hi there everybody! Today I'm going to be doing a hair tutorial on big bouncy curls. Uh, this is what I do every time I want my hair to look good for anything, so I'm going to show you how to do it. I first douse my hair in a hefty amount of dry shampoo. Uh, look, if I'm being honest, you can tell my hair is really, really greasy. It's probably been like four or five days since I've last washed it. Don't judge, I just, I shower every day, I just hate washing my hair, it is so daunting to me. So anyway, moving on, after I do that, I brush out my hair and then I am going to put in some of my Bellamy hair extensions. Um, I do not wear these daily, I just wear them when I want my hair to be full and thick um, for this look. So I first use a four clip weft, and these are, uh, I think they were 20 inches of the dirty blonde color, and I've just kind of cut them to my liking. So they're a little bit shorter than they would be. But I first do a four clip, and then I make another part around the top of my ears, and I'm going to put in another four piece clip. This one is a little bit longer than the first one because it is the widest part of my head. <laughs> and I clip those in, and this strand has a weird clip, like that one's kind of a little bit faulty, which is annoying, so it takes me a bit to clip it in. And I bring my hair forward, and I'm going to do two more pieces. Each one is uh, one clip, and I put them in just to uh, blend it out with the rest of my hair, because if you only have them on the bottom and not on the top, it looks kind of weird, but I don't want to have too much uh, volume in my hair, so I'm only putting in this amount. So that is the length. It's basically the length of what my natural hair is. I'm going to brush it all together to blend it. And, oh my gosh, here. One of my um, leftover pieces accidentally got stuck in my hairbrush, so that was very weird. If you hear my dog barking, I'm sorry. She is a nightmare. <laughs> I'm taking my curling iron. I think it is one and a fourth inch, I want to say. Um, but I will list it down below. So you have seen a million and one people do these kind of curls. I put my hair in, I heat it up, and I curl the top part of it. And then I bring it up and I curl the bottom half of it. And I kind of hold it in my hand so that I can um, keep the curl a little bit better. It kind of holds the heat in there as it cools down. And I'm going to speed this up. I do this away from my face on my entire head. It is the most simple and boring thing ever. But when you get, when you practice a lot, you get really quick with it. So that is it on the bottom half of my hair. I'm going to let those set, and I bring down some more of my hair. I'm realizing here that I want, I might need to do it in three layers, three sections. So I put a top samurai bun on the top of my head, and then I'm going to brush out this rat's nest of a hair, and do the same thing to this section of my hair. I do best when I start from the back, and then work my way forward, just so that it's like I can curl it. And push it out of the way, you know? So that whole section is done and they look like Shirley Temple curls. Let's go on to the last section. And then that front like bang piece, 
I curl the same as absolutely anything else. I actually like to give it a really good curl because I like it to fall in my face nice and curly at the end. Now I take my Blow Pro hairspray and I spray the whole thing. I don't do too much. This hairspray is nice because it doesn't make your hair crunchy or crusty or too stiff. I brush my hair through it. You know, I would like to keep the curls um, set a little bit longer uh, so that they hold throughout the night, but for th or throughout the day. But for the sake of this video, I'm just brushing it out, and I will just keep brushing until I get it to where I want. And then I take a comb and I go in and I kind of zhluff. Zhluff? Is that the word? <laughs> zhuzh. <laughs> I zhuzh the ends of it <laughs> to give it some volume. <laughs> zhuzh. I don't even know if that's a word. This stuff, this L'Oreal Boost It spray, is awesome. And I have this weird thing that I like where I spray it in the front of my hair and I kind of backcomb it. And it looks weird right now, but I smooth it down. You'll see why. I don't do this all the time because it can't be the best for your hair. But I end up smoothing. I make these two little rat's nests like under my bangs and it lifts the hair up out of my face and I just like the way that that looks. So and I take my Orbe spray. I know this stuff is so expensive. I make this last. I've had this for like two years. I just make it last. I don't use a lot and sometimes I spray it in and zhuzh up my hair a bit more. I just keep brushing. And I play around with it unnecessarily for a long time until I get it to how I like it. And I like when it gets smoothed out like that throughout the night. And I'll show you the back here. And that is it. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you would like to see more videos from me, please subscribe or comment what you'd like to see. And thank you so much for watching today. Bye!